You've done it again, haven't you? Everything's set. Just the way you need it to be. The mood is right. You get started. Why is this light flickering? And this one? That one too? Why is this happening? Well, there's a complex reason, but an easy explanation for it. And I'm going to tell you how to fix it as easily as possible. Subscribe for more tutorials just like this one, and check out my short films playlist. All your plugged in electrical appliances, including lights, cycle on and off at a given frequency, commonly 50 or 60 hertz, depending on where you are in the world. If you want to eliminate flicker, you need to shoot at a shutter speed or shutter angle that syncs up with your region's electrical frequency, so that in essence, your shutter speed doesn't record the off fractions of a second, causing the flicker during playback. High shutter speeds will almost certainly cause flicker. Without diving too deep into the math, let's assume we're using a standard 24 frames per second at a 180 degree shutter angle, or 1 48th in shutter speed. This could cause some flicker if shooting at 60 Hz in North America. You could remove flicker by dialing in your shutter speed to 1 30th, or up to 1 60th. These are intervals of 60. In low light, it may even be advantageous to you to get that extra bit of light by shooting 1 30th instead of 1 48th. And chances are, you aren't shooting slow motion in darkness. True, your preferred motion blur might be altered a bit in 24 FPS, but for the same reason as before, you might not be shooting fast paced motion under low artificial light. By the way, none of this matters if you shoot in constant sunlight or DC power, since there are no alternating currents to show the on off cycles that would cause flicker. So experiment by deviating slightly in shutter speed from your preferred shutter angle and motion blur. You'll find you can easily fix your light flicker and perhaps even benefit from a slightly slower or faster shutter speed.